Hello and welcome to Watch Mojo UK's Weekly Lowdown, a super serious UK news show about some things you care about and some things you probably don't. So, first off... Get thee behind me, foul fiend. After you. Now, towards the end of last year, a teaser trailer was released for a new show called Good Omens, a story of good and evil, heaven and hell, based on the Neil Gaiman and Terry Pratchett novel of the same name. And a week or so ago, we finally got a full trailer for it, and it just looks so good, we couldn't not talk about it. So Good Omens follows an angel, played by Michael Sheen, and a demon, played by David Tennant, as they search for the missing Antichrist to try and prevent the apocalypse. And going from the trailer, it kind of looks like Kevin Smith's Dogmen meets a quirky Wes Anderson film, and with a cast to make your eyes water. There's Sheen and Tennant, of course, as well as John Hamm, Miranda Richardson, Michael McKean, Jack Whitehall, bit of a weird one there, and apparently Benedict Cumberbatch as the voice of Satan. So Benedict Cumberbatch's Smaug then. Do you think flattery will keep you alive? And if there are any fans of the book, fear not, because Neil Gaiman has actually written all six episodes and he's an executive producer on the series, so hopefully he'll cut out any unnecessary, unfaithful dilly-dally. And Good Omens comes out on May 31st via Amazon Prime Video. And can we just appreciate for a second how cool David Tennant looks in these wibbly-wobbly, deemy-weemy steampunk shades? What a boss. And speaking of wibbly-wobbly, I just want to give you guys a heads up that this weekend we will be posting a video on the top 10 reasons Doctor Who Series 11 was actually good. So, those of you who liked Series 11, prepare to go, yeah, 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 yeah. Those of you who didn't like it, prepare to be triggered. <sighs> no. What the f***? Now, it's time for some vegan schmooze. Vegan schmooze. With this week's topic of discussion being McDonald's vegan chicken nuggets. Yes, the fast food chain has started trialling the new vegan treat in Norway to see if it takes off with a view of adding it to its main menu, we're assuming elsewhere around the world. And of course, these vegan chicken nuggets won't contain chicken at all. That'd be ridiculous. Instead, these fried goods contain mashed potato, chickpeas, onion, carrots, and corn. Yum. But that's in Norway, I hear you say. No way they're gonna come to the UK. Well, that may be the case, but stranger things have happened. Just ask Greg. We did get a few responses concerning the topic from you guys in our YouTube community tab, actually. Some keywords that jump out include terrifying, f no, dick move, and this emoji. Vegan schmooze. Now, Cory fans have been losing it this week as yet another mystery has swept the street. Who is responsible for the roof collapse and the injury of several key characters? Well, according to the showmakers, there are six suspects, although going by the track record of soap operas, it'll probably be neither of them, just to throw you off the scent. It's probably someone from Hollyoaks. Or it might be me. But who do you reckon it was? Gary and Robert seem the obvious suspects. Or do they? And we actually wanted to take this opportunity to ask you guys if you want to see us make more soap opera videos. More Corrie, EastEnders, Hollyoaks, Emmerdale. Just let us know what your favourite soap opera tipple is in the comments. In other news, this Wednesday was the International Day of Happiness. Did you feel it? David Beckham admitted to using his mobile phone while driving. I wonder if he was using the new LA Galaxy S10. I'll get paid to sign. And Joss Stone performed in North Korea as part of her Play in Every Country World Tour. Because why not? See you next week. Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo UK, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.